So what is up with airplane food anyway? Is he trying to be funny? I don't, but I know a good tart when I see one. I don't think I could swallow any more metal right now. <gasps> That's right, metal. Then, sir, I'm afraid you'll have to step into the back with me. Rules are rules. You have 15 minutes to place your bets. Yep, this is the area. Well, that's the hole I saw Carlos' metal detector fall through. Oh, no. Yeah, that's right. It's in the poop. Let's go in the poop. I'm not going in there. What do you mean, not going in there? You need to go in there. I'm not going in there. You need to find it. See? This is why I don't have a pet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> if you're not gonna go in there, how am I supposed to get it? Oh, no. I'm not going in there. Mmm, smells good. But I'd rather eat my own arm. Where we can fish it up. I don't want to mess up my blade. Anything? Nothing. Let's fish it out. Aha! There we go. Cool. A little stinky, but it could be worse. It could be. Okay. Um. Now we've got the metal detector. We can, um, man, my memory is so short. Why do we need the metal detector again? Hmm. Metal detector. Why do we need metal detector? Ah, so we can find the key in the mess that um, my employee, unfortunately, I don't really want to do that. No, I mean like. Can you... I don't really want to do that. Nothing in the dishwasher. I don't really. Okay, so we don't need to wash it. Probably a bad idea, anyways. Um. Oh yes, the bees. Let's get talk to these guys for a second. I don't really want to do Let's that. Put that away. Hey, can I borrow this book? No dice, Cumberbund. So, uh, what did you think of the poem? I liked it. It was sad and beautiful, like my mother. I despised it. It was too short. It said nothing to me, like my father. I had no feelings about it. It was aloof and licked itself too much, like my cat, Mr. Trotsky. Stay classy, guys. Stay classy. Okay, um, let's go get the key. Maybe that will open up the lighthouse. Or oh, many other things. Okay. Okay, I'm a little lost now. Where am I? Okay, well, I'm stumped. Again. No surprise there, right? Okay, maybe we can just leave. Alright, so I'm ready to sail. On what? On the limbo, man. Let's go. Manny, 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 the limbo's not a passenger ship. She's small cargo, son. And every hand on board works. Um, yeah, I'll, I'll work. work. 
What are your skills? Sales and restaurant management. Oh, hey, there is one opening on the Limbo's crew. Yeah? Yeah, it's in the engine room. And your buddy Glottis would be perfect for it, but he'd have to get his own tools. Okay, so... What tools does he need? What kind of tools does Gladys need? Authentic CB equipment only. And um, where do I get that? Where do I get authentic CB equipment? Why don't you ask a CB? Afraid of getting stung? <laughs> Very funny. Okay, I think I know who to ask. Okay, if I get Gladys some tools, can we board? Uh, he can, yes. No offense, Manny. But there's just no place for you aboard the limbo. She's fully manned already. In fact, her whole crew is on board, ready to sail at dawn. <laughs> Except for that one guy. Yeah, who's that one guy? Who's the one guy who hasn't boarded yet? Yeah, well, Seaman Arrange is a little late. But he'll be here before they sail. Ah, so that's who they were talking about earlier. Um... Yeah. Where do you think Naranja is? Probably home selecting recipes for the trip. Um... Yeah, what did he have? Sounds like a cook. What job did Naranja have? He ran the galley. Aha! Restaurant management. Yeah, it's similar to what you're doing now. <laughs> Except the fish is fresher on the limbo. Of course. Mmm, fresh fish. I haven't had sushi. Well, not sushi. Sashimi in a long time, and I love my fish. Okay, um, yeah. What if Naranja doesn't show up? I can fill his spot, right? Manny, you're not even in the Maritime Union. I know that, and you know that, but we're two guys who can keep secrets, right? Glottis is exempt, but the captain will ask for your card. And if you don't have one, they'll serve you to the sharks like chum. And what's worse, I'll get fined. That's a tough union boy, and I don't mess with them. Okay, seems like we have to go through the corruption system, or... This demolish the corrupt corruption system. So let me get this straight. If I get Gladys some tools, then I can get him a job on the limbo. And if Simon Naranja doesn't show up for work, but he will, and I get a maritime union card, which you'll never get, then I can sail on the limbo in the morning. Jeez. I guess so. I'd better go finish packing. I, you do that, son. Okay, I need tools. It's locked. I know, I locked it. The SS Limbo needs a little TLC. Sure does. The SS... Okay, so I need tools. What, what do you it got? shone pale as bone as I stood there alone. And I thought to myself how the moon that, that night cast, cast its, light its light on my heart's true delight. And, and the reef where her body was, was strewn. Hey, you guys both know the song. Don't have that kind of equipment. <laughs> Ooh, it's spooky down here. Ooh, it's... Okay, so... I guess now we know what I need. Tools and... A card. Nope, can't go across there. Let's ask these boys. What's the buzz, boy? I mean, you know what's wrong, Manny? We workers have to do everything that they tell us, and, and we just don't want them. Yeah. But before that, um,. You guys know a seaman, Naranja? Nah, CBs and sailors don't mix. But you're in the same union. Well, maybe so, but some traditions are sacred there, Manny. Fair enough. Um, yeah. Since you're not using your tools, think I could borrow them? Well, we sold them to feed our families. Then how are you ever gonna work? I, I told you things were messed up down here, Manny. I, I told you. Oh, man. That's a tough life. Anyways. How about the card? 
Hey, can I borrow one of your union cards? What, are you kidding? You know how much I had to pay Chow Chilla Charlie to get mine? You bees gotta be strong. Easy for you to say, Topsider. Charlie? That's who they sold it to? <sighs> Where to go? Where to go? So they sold the tools. Who did he sell it to though? Anyways, at least we've got a clue where the where they got the union card. And that's um Charlie. So I guess the idea is to speak to Charlie. Fed you play. There we Manny? go. Yeah. Can you make reasonable union cards? Manny, are you going to start moonlighting, or are you just looking to hang out with the sailors? Can you do it or not? Hmm. I have a deal for you. If you can retrieve my money from Maximino, I can make you president of that crooked union. I don't need to be president. And why does Max have your money? I put a whole suitcase of it up for collateral on a rather large wager last month. The race was fixed, Manny. They stole my money like common thieves. Here, take this VIP pass and use it to get into the High Rollers Lounge. They won't let me in there anymore. There should be a safe somewhere in the wine cellar, and my suitcase should be in it. And you can get me a card tonight. If you make it back, Manny, the card will be on the table. Very nice. So now we got the VIP card. We can finally go up to that fancy area. For VIP only, so. Oh, wait, no, he was a Frenchman, wasn't he? Regardless, we can go there now. And then we might have some more clues on how to fix the race. Oh, well, not fix the race, but get the winning ticket numbers. Why do I want the winning ticket numbers? I don't know. How to further the story? I'm not sh too sure either. Now, so that's the card dealt with. Where do I get the tools? That's the question. Don't forget, ladies and gentlemen. Let's just. Is that it? The VIP pass or the High Rollers Lounge that Chow Chilla Charlie gave me. Ooh, better not show that to Gladys. <laughs> Okay, let's go. I'm sorry, monsieur, but... Here's my pass, Jean-Claude. Now shut those doors and drive. Oui, monsieur. But actually, my name is Raoul. Tuesday is Kitty Hat Day. <laughs> hey. Fancy. So this is where they do the beer taps, I guess. Oh, I can climb. Well, that was a waste of time. Ooh. Looks like the pantry. Nothing inside, man. Looks like a turkey baster. Let's take that. Looks like a turkey baster. Yes, it is. Now, open this up. Anything Not inside? Not picking that up. Oh. Looks like cans of some sort of canned meat. Oh, I really hope this isn't where the old race cats end up. Oh. I don't need any cat meat. So ask around. Busy as ever, I see. Hmm. Well. What's with the attitude? 
Okay, so I can't really go anywhere else. Oh wait, yes, I can. Oh, this is exclusive as hell. I don't no have the remote, and I don't think they get any other channels anyway. Race results. Race results. Yeah, what are they? Race results. I don't have the remote, and I don't think they get any other channels anyway. So down that way goes there. It's down here. Ah, here we go. Boy, that Nick sure gets around. Sure does. Nick Virago, what are you doing working in the High Roller Lounge? I would think Maximino's private lawyer would have his own office. I do, but they don't serve drinks there. Got a little lipstick on you, lover boy. I already got rid of that, and I can do the same to you, Calavera. So if I were you, I'd keep my jaw shut. Hmm. Let's see which one to choose. Yeah. Who do you like in the fourth race? Well, there's a white-footed tabby in gate two that's looking strong, but has a slight eye infection. But you think he's going to pull out of it and win anyway, right? No, that puss-eyed puss is going to lose. But nobody knows, and I'm going to make a mint. Oh, okay. I have to tell this to someone. I hate cats. Me too, but they keep the lights on around here. Yeah. I doubt it is, but let's find out. Everything all legal with the kitties? Yes. They keep themselves pretty clean. Yeah. Nick, I need a lawyer. You get yourself in some kind of trouble, Calavera. Um, hmm. <laughs> Try not to go at us. No, I don't need someone duking Booth. Um, not that. Yeah, let's go with this. This will intrigue him. I'm starting a class action suit. Lots of money involved. Who are you deep pocketing? What's the difference to you? They're loaded. So will you be needing a regular lawyer or an excellent lawyer? Ooh. An excellent. an excellent lawyer. Any excellent lawyer or the best excellent lawyer? Well, the very best. The very best is good enough for me. And who would you say that would be, Calavera? Who would you say is the best lawyer you know in all the land of the dead? Oh. This guy wants his ego stroke. Well, fair enough. I'm willing to stroke his ego. You are, Nick. That's right. And that's why Maximino retains me on an exclusive basis. So, sorry, but I don't do odd jobs. Shame. But that looks interesting. It has a key in it. It's Virago's cigarette case. Nah, he'd see me do it. Ah, they have an item. Don't know why I need a turkey based stuff. So it said something about race track two, right? How's tricks, Nick? Yeah. Yeah. Virago, I really need a lawyer. Well, my dance card is full. So what are you gonna do? Hmm. Hmm. I have a gun. Oh, blackmail. I'm pretty sure you got it covered somehow, right? I'll go with the first one. I'll ask Max if I can borrow you. He doesn't like sharing his counsel any more than he likes sharing his girlfriend. So don't bother. Okay. 
Yeah, I guess we'll go with this route. I could tell Max about you and Olivia. That sort of claim could send a man like Max into quite a rage, especially if the messenger had no proof. Max and I are friends. He'll believe me. People believe what they want to believe, Calavera. And I want to believe you're a smart man who doesn't go around spreading dangerous rumors. I've got to talk to Max for a moment. When I get back, I hope you're gone, because I'm sick of looking at you. Yes, he left the cigarette case. Time to take. Man, this is gonna get me in trouble. Yeah. There's something rattling inside. Must be in a hidden compartment somewhere, but I don't see a latch or anything. Really? It's Virago's cigarette case. <clears throat> I can't open the part that I think has the key in it. That's weird. Hmm, oh well. Let's look around. I'm not gonna mention about this giant cat statue. Who needs a giant 24 oh, karat gold cat? Ah, who needs a cat, period? Good kitty. I think they'd notice me walking out of here with that. <laughs> okay, let's look around some more. Okay, so that does a full revolution. Anyways, let's look around. Oh. Sleepy. It's the button for the elevator. Let's press it. Hey! I'm trying to get some sleep over here. Oh, okay. Um <laughs> let's beat up that waiter. Hey, yeah. let's beat up that waiter. Not a bad idea. But these new. Give him a break. Okay, fair enough. Going down. Going down? Probably later. Yeah. Maybe you could take me down now. Oh yeah, I could take you down, but I can't eat customers anymore. Uh, <laughs> we go down the elevator. No, down in the elevator. I want to go down in the elevator. That's true. They wouldn't see me hit you in there, but I still get in trouble. Ah uh, man. Um. Yeah. Why can't you hit customers anymore? Exactly. It makes no sense. Well, it makes a lot of sense. Anyways. Just open the elevator door. Then they really see us fighting. <laughs> Ooh, how about a bribe? How about a bribe? Look at me. What can you give to a guy who has everything? Okay, what about this? I don't want to fight. I just want to use the elevator. Chicken. Sorry. Don't mind me. Just passing through. To where? The elevator. Doubt it. Can't I go down to the cellar? It's a wine cellar. Wine goes down there. Okay. Nighty night. <laughs> <laughs> I thought so. What are you doing? I wanted some wine. Oh, look at what a mess you have made. Get out of here. Hey. What about my vino? It's not self-serve. You'll just have to wait until I get around to it. I don't think it would be a good idea to barge into Max's office while he's meeting with Nick. Okay, I kind of teleported. I don't I, know. I don't know where I am. I got a hunch the wine comes out here. Sure does. Let's make another mess. I told you to stay out of here. I wouldn't have to come in here if the service were a little faster. <clears throat> Just get pound on me. Hmm. There's gotta be something I can do. Right. So a reason why I can go in here. I don't need any cat meat. Like, what's that on top? I don't think I use the turkey baster to get really it out. I don't really want to do that. I don't really want to do that. I don't really want to do that. I don't think so. I don't need any cat meat. No, but you might need the tin. What's that thing on top? Hmm. 
Demons can't be reaped. Hmm. Now that guy really needs his beauty rest. <laughs> Wait, maybe I can use the turkey base to drain this. Hey. But why? I don't really want to do that. The sink is full of dirty hookah water. These plates are filthy. Wait, why did I get the filthy hookah water? It's a turkey baster full of dirty hookah water. Okay, why did I do that? How does that help me? Yeah, let's show Gladys the VIP. Hey. I don't really want to do that. I don't think that would get me the key. Check out this fancy pass to the High Rollers Lounge. Can you believe how full of themselves they are over there? I don't think their place is any more VIP than ours, do you? I don't know. I, I try to stay away from th that place. Really? Why? Because of my, my, my problem. Gladys? Compadre? Oh, no. What problem? I can't believe I kept him from putting headers on that thing for so long. I can't believe... Ooh, ooh, Michi. <laughs> okay, so Glottis just ran. Okay, so Glottis. Oh no, did he just drink all that wine? Maybe he did. Maybe that way I can go down to the cellar. Let's hope he did exactly that. Oh. Get up, you stupid cat! Okay. This is it. I thought so. He had a gambling problem. Come on! You can do it! Oh, if I had only known! You can do it! I had no idea you liked gambling so much, Gladys. Well, the doctors made me promise I wouldn't do it anymore. But they can't get in the high rollers loud, Doc, can they? Get that mouse! Get that mouse! Gambling problem is a very dangerous Run. problem. You should never take it lightly. Get up, you stupid guy! Coming cat. home soon? I'm visualizing. Run! Oh, if I had only no coming home. What? Don't talk, kitty cat. Just run, baby! Meow, baby! Oh, this guy's a problem. Coming home. What did you say, little kitty? Don't talk, kitty. Get that mouth! Hey, don't make me come down there for it, Rumpel Stillskin! Ah, uh, Gladys. That's such a problem. Hey! What's this? Oh, that reminds me. I forgot about my date with Inez. Oh, no. Hello, operator? Yeah, it's me, baby. 
How'd you know? Hey, don't say that, sweetheart. You know I meant to stop by and... I'm more happy about leaving town every minute. <laughs>